Hello, i 5 gamers. Today, we're going to continue with the Chinese New Year event and then do something else afterwards. I actually haven't even decided yet. <laughs> I'm just doing this on the fly. Here we go. All right, day 16 or whatever this is. <laughs> Let's uh, accept materials here right from the start. Beautiful work. And hi, coordinator. What's up? Happy New Year, Miss Restorer. First year, or first you asked me to help you prepare tea snacks, and then I asked you to restore my old folding fan. After all that, it feels like we're already old friends. Even though we met literally like two weeks ago. This is also how I like to manage the Grand Theater. Whether as one person to another, or merchant to the customer, we go back and forth, letting our trust flow like a merry stream. I believe your antique shop also operates in the same way, Recently, I've heard nothing but praise for your hard work around town. This is clearly a good omen. Yeah, we gotta change whatever happened last time, or to the old shopkeeper or whatever. All right, there are still stuff to do. Let's see, so we got the crown, model machine, and harmonica. And that's it, then we're done with everything. So let's do the crown first, since the next one up. Uh, today, let's repair the lion dancer's crown. A ceramic crown. Regarding craftsmanship, it appears slightly cruder than the other objects to be repaired, and the fractures indicate that the base seems somewhat peculiar. He prepares fireworks for the lion dance performance. The lion dance? Okay. Every year, and enthusiastically promises to prepare some for us. We must do a good job of restoring his crown. This is another order our shop has accepted. The owner of this item hopes it can be restored to its original state. Yeah, I mean, that is our job. There are many old markings on it. The specific style of these old markings would have made quite an impression on me when I was younger. This is the only ceramic object among our received items. Once you have accepted this order, remain faithful to the original appearance of the object and focus on restoring its, uh, it first. Okay, then. Well, I think I already noticed all the mistakes. We got this is missing, this is missing, this is missing. Or I guess one's dirty, not a missing thing. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I swear. These are like all so easy to spot. There was like a couple days where it was like, where, where are these things? But now it's all like really easy. And we definitely do have enough materials to, uh, to fix this one. Uh, ceramic objects are originally made by firing ceramic, which is composed of minerals in different proportions. So... Compared to the other materials, ceramics have a looser structure, are more porous, and have a higher water absorption. The objects inlaid on this crown have come off due to its fragile nature, so there are also large and small cracks. In addition, the rest of it is quite dirty. Something about this feels a little unusual, but it'll be difficult to confirm what it is for now. I should go gather up the materials first. Well, we have said materials, so we don't really have to worry about that. Boom. Let's submit and... Oh, it said something about 7 out of 7. Oh, no, I think that was just like with general and items, not like all the items that we've done so far. I've purchased the colorants, and besides the fragments that were sent along with the item, I have also prepared some other fillers. Oh, there's also some adhesive, which boasts a good degree of fluidity and can achieve the best bonding effect when the fractures are fully wetted. I carefully clean and stick the broken crown together, maintaining almost the same color as before. Please wait for the item's owner to return. Okay, that was kind of fast. What's up, Creature Pearson? Oh, take a look at this beautiful crown. Aha! The craftsmanship of your resident restorer is certainly nothing to sneeze at. Yeah, I feel like I really got myself a good deal in trusting this to you. Strolling through the streets every day, I always seem to come across something interesting. Where did you find this crown? Let me guess, on a homeless person? Now that's a story. It was all quite a coincidence, really. I was walking out of Dancing Dragon Plaza when I saw a peddler setting up a stall in the alley. A few people were standing around watching him. This peddler was a stranger here. You see... It seemed as though he was arguing with someone about something, so I went to see what all the fuss was about. I love drama. <laughs> the peddler said that this crown was a rare treasure, but unfortunately, he had accidentally broken it and decided to hold on to the pieces. If it weren't for the Lunar New Year on the way, 
and he was in need to buy a few things for his family for the holiday, he wouldn't have been willing to sell it at a low price otherwise. Were they arguing about the authenticity of this crown? That's right! Some passerby said his story was all just a scam, and then the vendor went on a great length, spouting a bunch of proof to back up the family history of his treasure. Interesting, I'm almost surprised he didn't steal it considering you are a thief! But then again, I guess like, the, the characters when they're in like events, they're like other world versions of themselves, so it's like they're not, he's not actually a thief, it's just, it is just, it's creature Pearson, but like, it's not thief, you know? Because Gardner is not a gardener. Or she's just like, oh, if I was in another world, I'd be a gardener. <laughs> uh, there was another gentleman on hand who looked like the cultured type. And he confidently analyzed it to prove its authenticity in a number of ways. I didn't understand most of it. But he did say that these old markings could not have been forged. Then, guess what happened? The person who started questioning him was at a loss for words. It seemed like he'd pay anything to buy it from him. But the peddler refused, saying he must have had some ulterior motives up his sleeve. So, you bought this crown from him? The setup of this story sounds a bit suspicious. Could they have been working together to pull the will over his eyes? That's what I was thinking, yeah, I was about to say. Couldn't, like, this other guy just be like, yeah, I'm a professional analyzer, you can totally trust me. Yeah, this is totally real, bro. I'm totally not like this guy's brother or anything, like, yeah. <laughs> Um, that's right! I bought it! I'm lucky I came over at just the right time! Don't you think? I didn't just do it to pick up a bargain! The peddler looked so down on his luck! And I thought it would be best for him to not be roaming the streets during the Lunar New Year instead of being with his family. Well, that is nice, but what if he got scammed, bro? <laughs> And I did it all despite the fact that the Lion Dance's spotlight has been snatched away by your Dragon Dance troupe this year. I suppose you might say I'm something of a philath philanthropist. But after bagging a bargain as huge as this, I guess you could also call me a thief? Oh! If only the Trick Master knew, he'd probably be green with envy. <laughs> oh, now that I think about it. Uh, I heard someone behind me saying that they saw this vendor in Chinatown long ago. He was driven out of town after his business went bust for some reason. Perhaps only people who live and breathe the marketplace can truly understand the plight of the needy. But still, uh, how much did he ask for this crown? It certainly wasn't much. Otherwise, how could I claim to have found such a huge bargain? If I were reduced to selling off my stuff on the street, all those precious pearls and trinkets, you can't wear them, you can't eat them, so they'll never be as valuable as a steamer full of steamed buns and a hot bowl of soup. Very well. Actually, there are a few things regarding this crown that we're still unsure of. Could you please come back in a couple days? Of course, that won't be a problem. I'll leave it here for you professionals to do your research, then. Maybe you'll even find out something amazing about the thing. You've really done a great job of this restoration. I'll go and buy the Dragon Dance fireworks, I promised you. Dang, we're not even done with the job, though. Well, I guess we did fix the crown, but we gotta, like, research it more. You certainly came to the right person for help, if I say so myself. Fireworks sometimes accompany Lion Dance performances, so I'm definitely the man for the job. I'm good friends with the Chinatown Fireworks Maker, and they've got a wide range of fireworks of all kinds of specifications. Thank you so much, Lion Dancer. Yeah, we got fireworks, woo! Now we just need a fire breather, which is, it's gonna be Bon Bon, and then remote control fireworks launcher, which I'm not sure what that's gonna be, but whatever. Let's take a peek at the side quest here. Come one, come all, indulge yourself in tea house experience beyond your imagining. With every tea refreshing under the sun awaiting your selection, you're guaranteed to walk away with a smile. Oh, we meet again, wanna help me promote? I'd be happy to help, I don't know how to though. Well, you just, you just do the thing, yep. You just do it. <laughs> oh boy. Um, let's see here. What, what exactly happened though? You seem to hold those small teacups next to me. I see, so she's basically a poster child. Um, it's admirable how she takes care of the tea house's affairs all by herself. Once you're done here, remember to come to the Grand Theater's kitchen. Been working on some new tea snacks and you can eat them. Taste test them. Woo! 
Uh, and then she has some stuff. Whoa, we got paper! Yes, thank you for the paper! Yes! Happy Lunar New Year, Mr. Porter. Have you come for a divination? Happy Lunar New Year! I came to find a little good luck. Oh, is this one? What does this slip mean? Oh, it means you're gonna die tomorrow. I mean, what? Uh, it'll be much stress and strain. Your spirit will hang high in the darkness? What the heck? Uh, what the... Okay, like the shining moon. The wind is brisk, the moon is bright, and the swallows fly with soiled their beaks, repairing their nests. I believe that all your wishes for the coming year will come to fruition. After a lot of stress, apparently. <laughs> Recently, business have significantly improved for me, too. I hope the coming year brings great things. Let's all enjoy the new year. I received these supplies, supplies from a patron. Here, just have them. She just comes to his store and is like, yeah, you can just have these things because I don't need them, I guess. All right, let's see what the ranking is. Yo, people are in the 700s. Uh, this is actually crazy. Yo, somebody's like over seven, oh, 100 over everybody else. That's insane. That's actually insane. Okay, well, now I'm in the top 5% almost. That's good. I was looking at the Asia account, though. People are in the 800s already. It's insane. I mean, I think they're like a day ahead of us, but like, I don't know. It's still kind of crazy. Oh, I just hit the mother load. Look at this. Look at all these orbs. Oh, my gosh. Yo, I actually hit the mother load there. Oh no, and then I, dude, that's so cheap. When they spawn on top of you, what are you supposed to do? That shouldn't be a thing, they shouldn't, oh, I hate this. When they spawn on top of you, it's so cheap, bro. Oh, can I hit 25? Yo, I hit 25, I'm crazy. Oh, I think that's a new record. Let's go, dude, I'm insane. By the way, I don't think I mentioned enough. I really love this uh, login screen. I don't know why it's like glitching out right now. Bro, it's like glitching out right now. I don't know what's up with this. <laughs> what the heck, why is it glitching out? That's so goofy. Oh my gosh. Sorry, I just wanted to, I, okay, it never glitches out like this. I really do like this login screen though. It's really cool. It's like the same little trailer, but like they don't have like the voice lines over it. So it's just like, I don't know. I like it, it's cute. Alrighty gamers, here we go. This is rank, I think. I actually don't know, is Puppeteer in rank yet? I actually don't know if he's in rank yet. He might be. Um, but anyway, we got Hydra ranked Disciple here. Going up against uh, Antiquarian Female Answer Puppeteer Prosser. Whoa, fast box and slow box setup, you say? Oh. Oh, that's smart! Wait! Forces her to break the fast box for a free pallet stun into a slow box? No way. That actually wastes so much time. That's actually the new Valentine female dancer, is it not? And Puppeteer is right here, baiting out the next chase. Lewis? Just going to Lewis. He's in Lewis now. Yup, yup. Yo! Yo! That's actually so smart already. Dude! Puppeteer gaming already! Yo, this is kind of this is kind of hype. He's gonna take a hit here though. Lewis? Oh, but he did the- Oh, that's so good. That's so smart. Oh, but he's gonna- No, walks over to dodge the cats. Drop the pallet. Beautiful. Now he's back in. Gonna go back in the Matthias. Okay. But the jump, though? Oh, he went back in at Lewis. Okay. Well, now he can't use Lewis anymore. Um, he's actually gonna go down here. Hold on now. He's actually just gonna go down. He can drop pallet. Yikes. That was actually kind of a bad kite. Um... Well, he was not, like, in the best of areas, so it's fine. I'm sure if he was in a better area, he would have, uh... Would have had a better kite. Um, that's also Tide Turner Matthias as well. Um, so I don't know. I don't know who's gonna come in here for the rescue. But um, I guess it was. Yeah, it actually wasn't too bad. It wasn't too bad of a kite. But I guess I had the switch targets. I'm sure that that cipher maybe had a bit of progress on it. Actually, I don't know. I don't even know, bro. I don't even know. Um, but that that female dancer trick was kind of interesting. Setting up the fast box after the slow box, so you can get a pallet slam into a slow box. Like that's kind of crazy. Prospector is here. Opting not to throw a magnet. Do we oh. see? Oh, we don't really see. We're not really seeing much and camping here. Um, stun? No stun. Oh, stun. Okay, stun from Antiquarian. And there's the cats. He has to use Lewis. He has to use Lewis. Yup. He didn't use Lewis. What? He didn't use Lewis for some reason. Okay. Well now, yeah. Now Prospector has to. He has to clutch up here. He's got. There's two harassers, but they're harassing at four ciphers. That's kind of crazy. That is actually kind of insane. Okay, Prospector and Antiquarian. Oh, that's a big stun, but she dropped. All right, well now Prospector has no more magnets. Now it's Antiquarian's job. She can definitely balloon us to hear boop. And again, what the, that was kind of jank. And yep, uses Lewis to get out of there. Beautiful, but she has blink and cats ready. So yeah, female dancer is decoding. There's the cat. Um, Prospector does not have a magnet yet, but still kind of in the area. Dude, nobody's decoding, what the heck? Drops the pallet perfectly. Oh, but blinks for the kill. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. That makes sense. Don't wanna. Don't even bother breaking the, the pallet. There's the magnet. She has. She has got magneted. Can he get the stun? Can he get the stun? Oh, he can't get the stun. No, nope, can't get the stun. All right. Well, that's Propeteer's second chair. Um, Prospector is indeed injured, so she can actually go after him now. Yep. 
She knows you're back there. She can just send out cats if she really wanted to. But she's got to be careful of the rescue. Antiquarian is coming in. Dang, she kind of sniped that. Oh, never mind. She almost sniped that Antiquarian. Had she got that cat, that would have been dangerous. But now she has Cross, which is broken, honestly. I don't really know how to... Bro, what is the counterplay to Cross, like, actually? How do you actually counterplay it? I don't understand. <laughs> um, and then... Went into Lewis. Beautiful, dude. Lewis. That's actually so good. See, like, he would be getting farmed here if he wasn't Puppeteer. He would actually just be getting farmed off this chair so easily if it wasn't Puppeteer. Um, okay, he took a cat. But that's not... Oh, but he sets up cross. Jump. He has nothing. He has nothing to work with. What? Cross trying to body block? Doesn't get the body block, though. He has a magnet. Antiquarian is, has one staff use left, but I don't even know if she's nearby. Uh, stun, stun. Repel. That's uh, that's it. He's dead. Yeah. Well, that was that was interesting. They were scrapping. Yo, the he just never plays the top level. Just want to scrap. I swear. Um, although unfortunately, uh, the cipher progress is not looking that good. Female dancer has decoded three ciphers. I think she only decoded two. I think there was uh, another cipher that was done from earlier. But yeah, they had three people versus one hunter. Um, so yeah, it was it, honestly it was just like the early game could have been better. Um, which was crazy because even I thought it was like pretty good, but I don't know they, they, they could still make this a Three escape. I don't I think it's just, they're rotating now that yeah, that's that's the big thing and they're rotating now Rotating so well they, they can't she can't find a target she's like she's on her way to the antiquarian, but like look at all this time that they're buying just by like Rotate she's not even going the right way. Oh my gosh She's so lost she has no idea where anybody is because they're healing. Oh, now she sees a cypher, so you can just go to the cypher. Swaps to teleport? Is that te that is teleport? Yep, swaps to teleport. Yep. Um, now she finds Prospector, who does have one magic to work with. And, ooh, early cat, because she kind of predicted the path. Um, let's see here. Can he? Ooh, I didn't know you could do that. That's smart. You can cancel that stun. That's actually really smart. Oh, just off the teleport, yeah. Well, now this actually... I don't even hold on. Is this better for the process? I feel like this is better for the prospector now um, Because he had no more managed to work with breaks the box. Okay I think that's all the box is broken. So female dancer is now just a basic character uh, All she has is her drop from two-story area speed Ooh, misses the cats and kind of kind of hard to get the cats behind the walls, but crosses up and Drops pallet into get hit anyway because Anne's broken <laughs> Uh, I don't I, I don't know dude. I like I maybe it's just like me being bad, but I see I see Anne and I'm like, how do you Oh good palace on I, I see Anne I'm just like how do you like lose? <laughs> I don't know dude. Like cat just seems so good. It just seems so freaking good. Like you just jump towards it and then she's dead. Boom. Oh, but the pop though, hold on now. They actually got that pop. I mean like Soda Decoding was definitely active at that point. I wonder if Oh, oh the cat's not gonna make it in time, yeah. I I almost wonder if um the Asia players take accelerated decoding into account and maybe not focus so much on Cypher Rush? No, I feel like that's not really a thing, right? I don't know. I think mean, that, that's kind of what happened this game because they just harassed the Anne, made it so the puppeteer wouldn't go down for a long time. Oh, ran back towards her, very smart, but crosses up and yeah, okay, this is this is still a tie. Oh my gosh, guys, a disciple game that ends in a tie? What a, <laughs> who could have expected that? <laughs> still a good match regardless though. But yeah, I, I still think like no matter what, Cypher Rush is always important. Ooh, the Nidra Reflex. Wait, if Dungeon is like right up over there, she has this. Um, nah, I don't think she can make it. Cat, there's a pallet, she can go around. Is it just a pallet mind, it's a pallet mind game at this point? No, nope. she can now just dash toward you though. Boom, dead, yep. That's it, that's it. Um, Prospector's not gonna harass most likely, or even is he? Yeah, he's not gonna, yep. That's a tie. Good game though, good game. Next match, we got another peak tier ranked uh, forward here, Survivor. Uh, Antiquarian, forward, puppeteer, female dancer is the team with the Valentine skin, you'll love to see it. Uh, we are going up against uh, Oven Smiley here. Let's see what we got, let's see what we got. Uh, is running insolence, of course, as you do with Smiley. You pretty much need to run insolence to do anything with this character. Because uh, <laughs> without, uh, without his dash, he's pretty mid. Pretty mid indeed. Um, forward buying a lot of time. No, no, the thing is, you 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 just, in my opinion here, what I would do is just break these pallets. Cause forward's buying so much time because he has fast vaulting. Bro, smiley. Oh wait, 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 wait. Never mind. He's cracked. Never mind. Okay, maybe the patience paid off. 
Okay. Um, well, he almost has his dash. There it is. Yep. Beautiful. Let's see. Does he just go for dash now? Um, break a pallet first, please. Break a pallet. Blink. Oh, oh, wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. That was smart. He heard the, bl dude, he heard the blink and forward was like, nah, I'm going, bro. I'm going. He had to use up 50% of that ball though. 50%. He's he can actually chase a forward. He can actually just straight up chase a forward. Yep. Dude, Ford's pallet dropping speed is so fast. He's so, it's just so dummy fast, but whoa. Footballed all the way up here, but it's not gonna be enough. He's actually buying a good amount of time. Staying up there, smart, that's what you wanna do. Yup, beautiful work from the forward. Gets on these pallets up. Yo, Smite looks so goofy when he goes down the slide. He looks so goofy. There you go, finally break that pallet. And he should just be dead here. Did you see that? Though? Wait, he lost track of it. No, he lost track, huh? Even I know where he was going. What the? Okay, that was kind of jank. Oh my gosh, dude, this smiley keeps outsmarting him like so much, but he just is like, it falls short. Oh, wow. Even with the fast forward uh, pallet dropping speed, he's able to get that down, but that was still a three side for Kite. Um, yeah. Wait, he's chairing basement? What the? What are you? He's chair. Oh, he's chairing near the cipher. But I don't know. I feel like basement or that chair on the bridge was so much better. Um, are you gonna go after the person on the cipher? What are you? What is he doing? He's he's picking up time. He's like looking around for the seat of the rescuers. But like, then why chair here? Is this a good chair for him? I feel like it's not because he can just go up in the two story and then. Ops the basic hit, okay, then he can just dash. Oh, he's gonna body block. Body block Lewis. Wait, what? Why'd you run away? You had Lewis! Huh? I don't understand. Why wouldn't you want to take the hit for forward? Am I stupid? Well, now he's gonna tear on the cypher, but it's probably about to be done with all those dancer boxes, bro. Oh. Okay, threatening it, threatening it. That cypher is like surely almost done, though. That's the cypher they want to pop. Oh my gosh! Yo, all the boxes! All the boxes. <laughs> so it, it has a Valentine dancer. Yup. It's the Valentine dancer, but she didn't have the effects from the boxes, so I guess she doesn't have the accessory. That's kind of weird. Um. Oh, they're all here. Boop. Rescue, and that's that's surely primed, right? Uh, well, even then, it's like, dude, it's like got to be right there. It's got to be like right there. Oh my. Dude, it's what is the cipher at? I can hear it. it. sounds like it's almost ready. Yo. No, bro. Oh, he was so close. Does he have detention? I don't think he has detention either. He does not have detention. Oh, wait. No, I can't tell what the... No, I'm pretty sure that's not detention. <laughs> the oven eyes are already red, but I'm pretty sure that's not detention. Oh, this sucks, bro. This sucks for poor Smiley. Dude, Smiley, no. Your name is Oven, but you're the one who got cooked. Oh, this sucks. Oh. Well, he doesn't have the tension, so... Wait, but that's Antiquarian on the gate, though. She opens gate slowly. But he can just get on coaster. Is he gonna change targets to anti? Yep. Gonna change targets to anti, but, like... Honestly... Well, I guess... I guess he does have dash. You can... You can... You can live just hard for 18 seconds here, but... Yeah, he's gonna have dash back in six seconds. Um, dungeon is at the slide, I think. No, it's I can't tell actually. Uh, well, Angie's just dead here, right? Yeah, she's just done so. Okay, well he got his 1K. He got his 1K. Good work, Smiley. You got you know Dungeon's, Dungeon's not at slide. It's at the freaking uh, working carousel or whatever. All right, well that sucks for um that that sucks for uh, Anti, but you know I was I'm glad Smiley at least got 1K, right? I'm glad he got 1K because he he deserved that dude. Um, but I wonder what was his what was his build. Um, I don't know, because he has insolence, but no detention. Did he have trump card? Did he even... No, he only used blink, though. Did he have confined? I don't know. I actually don't even know. He didn't, like, go through a window at all, so I couldn't tell. Next match, we've got Bloody Queen up here. Evil Dragon Bloody Queen. Uh, going up against Cowboy, Prospector, Melly, and Forward. Again, with, like, this freaking pajama skin. I, like, only see this pajama skin. I swear, like, it's like... There's, like, a cult around the Forward pajama skin or something. <laughs> Uh, that's a really fast hit. Wow. Um, I mean, yeah, I, I'm really bad against Mary, too. I'm kind of traumatized against Mary after playing Barmit against into her, like, five times. 
I, I, I really don't want to fight Mary, but, you know, watching other people lose to Mary is, is fine, because now I know I'm not alone. <laughs> Melly, look out! Look out, Melly! Oh. Yeah, Cowboy, you can go down, bro. It's fine. I don't want Melly to go down, though. <laughs> Alright, so she breaks that really good pallet, the entrance to this uh, ruins area, and good lasso, good lasso, but he's running right into the mirror. He does have flywheel, though, so he can probably flywheel here. Let's see. Um, I don't know why he didn't flywheel. He died on Melly's cipher. For, 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 forward? Why did, why did he just flywheel? Why did he just flywheel right there? Uh, why did he just flywheel? I have one, there, there's one, okay, there are two reasons. One, misclick, which is what I thought it would be. Mirror hits the melee. Um, the other reason was to maybe make it, <laughs> he gets, oh, he doesn't get share hit. Oh, big stun, big stun, boom. I, I may, maybe he was flywheel to ma make the Mary think he was going for the, the, the football. Like, is that a thing? Is that a thing that people do? I feel like that's such a waste of a flywheel that, and he just gets clipped. Bro, Mary kind of sweeping them, what the heck? And now forward just gets clipped, right? Um, not that great of a mirror, uh, but never mind. It's actually pretty good because he just slowly pincers it, forces you to the football. There's not much football left, and then dead. Never mind. That was a beautiful mirror. It was. It wasn't really there to like hit him. It was there to uh, close him in. Yeah. Um, prospector here though. Harassment and not gonna make it in time. Nope. Not gonna make it in time. Bro, this Mary is destroying. She's actually just destroying them, bro. She can mirror them. Yup. Yup. Stun. Good stun from Prospector. But. Eh, eh. Is it enough? She's going for mirror hit. Hits the no, Melly! Four gets back up, though. Stuns against a tree, but it's not going to last that long. Yeah, that's a very small stun. Just blink. She can just blink this. Yup. She can just blink that. Prospector is here. But she just literally. What you do here is just mirror the Prospector, yeah? Or. Drops? Okay, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Prospect is crazy? Uh, gets it. He actually gets it. He gets it. He gets it, but he's forced to... Okay, fly, finally uses flywheel and doesn't get the body block. Um, well, now you have no magnets, buddy. One's going to be ready in like two seconds, but... Okay, hold on. And Tomal just gets back up. You love to see it, Melly. Let's go. Cowboy's dead, though. Cowboy's dead, and only one cypher is done. Oh, man. Bro, the, the hunters today are crazy, I swear. They're actually crazy. And boop! Fly away from the forward, beautiful football. Yup, yup. And now he's kind of hid, hidden inside that. Yup, okay, so now she has to swap. No blink, no anything. She's got... Uh, he actually just used the re like most of his football to make it there. Okay. Yup, yup. Are you threatening a blink? What are you doing? Okay. Uh, yeah, she's waiting for him here. I guess she was like maybe trying to pretend it's like, oh, I have blink, I have blink, but like he's he paid attention. He knows, he knows she used blink earlier. Like any any like high tier survivor would probably know the cooldown of blink. Like it's not gonna be ready. Not not then at least. Maybe maybe if it was like close to like 20 seconds, 10 seconds maybe. But like when it was like halfway in its cooldown, there's no way, dude. There's no way. Anyways, prospector is here. Wait, hold on. They actually have three ciphers done now. If Ento can cipher us fast enough, accelerate decoding is definitely a thing right now. Um, but mirrors back up. Prospector's here. And repels, st repels stuns. I actually get that. That's a long stun. But mirror just clips the forward though. Gets the magnet. She's waiting for the mirror. Yep, holding it, holding it, holding it, holding it, holding it. There's the mirror. Okay, then oh, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful patience from both players. Beautiful patience from both. And now she's like, nope, you're done, bro. I'm sick of you, Prospector. I'm done with you, bro. Man, Prospector's so good. Oh, and is he got that Cypher speed boost? Beautiful. Dude, Prospector's so good. He's actually so good. Like, the fact that you can just always pressure harassment because he never runs out of magnets. Because they're always like, I don't know, dude. Char characters with, whew, scary. Characters with infinite recovery items like are cracked. Uh, well, he just gets clipped by Mira now, right? He, he still has his flywheel. He doesn't even need it. I mean, he wasted that magnet, but yo, hold on. They're crazy. I don't know why Ento's not. What is Ento doing? 
Okay, now she finished the cipher. Let's go. Yo, they're doing this actually. All because of that prospector. And he's still there. He's still there. Bro, it's just the fact that like these characters with like infinitely recharging items are just so good. Like, could you imagine if like Melly slowly recharged her bees? Or like if Forward slowly recharged his football? Same with Anti. If, if Anti slowly recharged. Um... He's on foot. She's on Forward now. Wait, is Forward dead on chair? Am I stupid? I can't remember. Okay. Nope, he's not there. He's not there. And he's clipped. Yeah, he's clipped. Not, not enough. He has a gun? Wait, he got a gun from a chest. He got a gun. Melly, look out. Melly. Melly. Please. She's crazy. Please kite this mirror. Please kite this. No, that's going to hit. I knew that was going to hit. No. Melly. I'm so sorry. Wait, please don't let the four be dead on chair. I can't remember if he is. He has a gun, bro. I want to see him use that. It'll be so funny. Please don't be dead on chair. I, can I don't remember if he was or not. Please don't be dead on chair. Oh, thank goodness. Please, I need to see him use that gun, bro. I need to see him use that gun. I need to see him use that gun. Please. Please. It would be so funny. Melly, look out. Ah, Melly, look out. Get the rescue. No. Forward. Use your gun. Use the gun. Please use the gun. I'm begging you. Oh my gosh. Uh, I mean, I guess she knows he has a gun, probably. Okay, magnet, but the, the cypher. What the bot? Where? Just use the gun, please. I'm begging. I need to see it. Use it. Use it. <gasps> no! I need. I wanted to see that. Just use the gun, please. You have a gun. It'd be so funny. Prospector, please. Please, Prospector. No! Please get the stun. No! I want to see the gun, man. He doesn't have a magnet. That's it. No, but the gun! The gun! He got a gun and he didn't even use it. Come on, man. Wait, Melly. Melly, kite this out. Waste all your bees and pick up the gun. Pick up the gun, Melly, and shoot Mary. <laughs> please. Oh, please. Oh, um, your cooldown's gone. It's the bees. Okay, her bees are gone. She can get the gun. Melly, please go get the gun. Please go get the gun, Melly. Please go get the gun. Melly, please. I'm begging you, go get the gun. Prospector, please please tell me they're like in a team and they know he had a gun. Melly, look out. No, it's only a 47. No, we don't get to see the gun. Prospector, please clutch up. Clutch up, bro, clutch up. Wait, no, Melly used up herself heal already. No, this is it. That's it, no matter what. Okay, your mirror ran out. What is that? <sighs> Dude, this prospect is goaded, but like even he can't cut out like all this. Okay. Nice. Uh, bro, what do they do? What is he supposed to He's going back toward Melly. But mirror and... Okay, hold on. Wait. Hold. 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 Whoa! Yo, they were almost insane. Melly, please go get that gun. Please go get the gun, Melly. Yes, she's heading for it. Yo, go for the gun. Please go for the gun. Oh, she's trapped. Yo, come on, you two, please. Oh, she's fast. But she's going to get clipped. Dude, she has that charge attack speed boost freaking thing. That's why she keeps going for charge attack. I know she freaking has that. Oh, my gosh. No, you missed your magnet. No, that's it. Come on, I just wanted to see the gun, man. I wanted to see it so badly. You were lucky enough to get the 3% chance for the gun and you didn't even use it. Forward, come on, bro. That fly was goaded, but he just didn't use the gun. All right, here we go. Next match, final match. Melly, Wicked Witch, Redemption, here we go. This skin is so cool, dude. I can't wait till I have this skin one day. Uh, she's going up against a fish. We got Charles, Nort, and Small Child on the team. Move! Yo, small child players, even in Asia, bro. Even in Asia. The, even, even the Asia server small child players, they can't be fixed, bro. They just can't be fixed. All right, beautiful. Get a, get a good water off here, but Melly's crazy. Don't vault that! What? Oh. Oh, I was scared for my life, bro. I was so scared. Oh. She's going to water off all of Graveyard. Why are you so fast, fish? There's no reason for her to be this fast. Dude, she's just dead. 
She's just dead. No, Melly, she's watered off. She's gonna water off that whole area. Melly, no, no, Melly's clipped. She's clipped. She's dead. She's dead. She's dead. Melly, 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 no! Wait. She flywheeled the water. She's insane. Melly, please get out of the water. Oh, thank goodness. She fly with the water. She's insane, Melly. Melly, Melly. No. Oh, fish is so ugly, bro. She's so ugly. Melly, you even fly with the water. You were cracked and fish was still dumb. I'm so sad. Why do you have confined space? Fish could with fish with confined? No teleport? Does she I I mean, I guess Red Church has some I mean, what? I don't know actually. No, why does he have confined? Am I dumb? Can't can't Naya I mean, maybe the Red Church windows? But can't you just water it off? I don't know. All right, Charles with the tide. All right, Melly Redemption, Melly Redemption. Make her, you make her use Blink, Melly. Oh, couldn't bait a swing then. That's what she wanted to do there. She wanted to bait a swing. Um, okay, Nort, yes. Help her out, Nort, come on. Come on, Izuru Kamakura. <laughs> oh, scary. Come on, use Blink, you stupid fish. Waste your stupid Blink so Melly doesn't have to worry about it anymore. Charles, use Hover, push her back. Gosh dang it. Oh, Melly, look out. The bees! Oh my! Oh! Ellie! Yeesh! She has no more bees! No! Yeah, 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 yeah! Stun that fish! Stun that fish! Oh, Norton was so close, bro. He was so close, and now he, now she just waters off the cipher. I think she missed. Nope, she didn't miss, but she's still on it. Come on, Nort, please! <laughs> Nort, please, please, Nort, please, Nort! Nort! Oh no, he's got more. Ma Don't use it yet! Don't use it yet! Don't use it! Come on! Come on, save that, Melly. Save Melly. Save Melly. Come on. Norton, you bot. You bot. You didn't save Melly. Oh, my gosh. I can't watch this. Bro, I can't watch this. Stop. Stop letting Melly lose. Melly needs to win. She needs to five-step for Kai all the time. Buff Melly to her bees are infinite. Buff Melly so she can just fly above like Charles with her bees. Come on. Sacrifice yourselves for her. It's fine. I know she has no resources and only a flywheel, but she'll be fine. She's just going to blink down her. This is so cringe. She's literally gonna blink down her. That's so ugly, bro. Ah, oh, that's so ugly. Guys, if you're gonna do it, do it now! Oh my gosh. Oh, it's scary, bro. Melly, do something. Please, pick up a flare gun or something. <laughs> Look out! Oh, she's clipped. Flywheel! No, fish, you're so ugly. You're so ugly, bro. Nope. I'm not finishing this match. Nope. I refuse to finish this match. No, you're ugly, fish. Wait. Unless Norton harasses. Norton, do something. Bro, don't get watered off. No, no Norton, you're a bot. Save her. Save her, please. Do anything. You don't even have a match. Wait, he has one match. Norton. Norton. Norton, do something. His magnet ran out. His magnet ran out. They struggle 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 i'm nope 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 i'm not watching this i don't i refuse i refuse i refuse i refuse nope i'm not finished this match i don't even care i don't even care i don't even care i don't even care man i don't even care all right guys kreeberg race course melly again the same melly <laughs> we got female dancer valentine's uh we can wish melly of course charles you'll love, love to see some more charles gaming antisquarian and blubby queen freaking marathon <laughs> marathon <laughs> All right, Melly, 10 Cypher Kite right now. Here we go, I'm ready. Dancer, you're a bot? Oh, she's got the fairy effects. I said stop and get that palace on for free, beautiful. All right, you'll love to see it. Um, but that also did waste a box and you're clipped. Oh, but the spin though, hold on. Dancer's crazy, dancer is insane. Uh, flywheel, no, you're not flywheel up yet. Oh, she doesn't even have flywheel. Get on the horse! Get on the horse! Get on the horse! She hit the horse! You are so horrible! Animal cruelty, Mary! Nope. Nope. You're a bot. Just get on the horse! Bro! I mean, I know you can get run off the road, but it's funny. I just want to see some horse gaming. Oh, oh, oh. Slow box. Pallet. Beautiful. But Blink is here. Blink is here. Blink is here. Wait, that's a fast box. What? I guess I can help you. Spin. Beautiful. Just Blink. Swap, blink, swap, blink. Yep, swap, and then blink. Then he's down. All right, dance is crazy. Melly tried to help support with the bees. 
Yeah, she forced Oh, Mr. Blake! Ha 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 Oh. Whoa, Melly's so fast! Whoa! She's zooming over here! Melly, pick up a gun! Shoot her! You got this, Melly! Melly, you got this! You're crazy. Oh, she set up the she set up the, the she set up the bees! She set up the bees, the honey! Melly, no! So early! What? Your bees! Your precious bees! Oh, Melly, Melly, it's so early! Melly, no, so early, Melly! No, 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 Melly, that's way too early! That is way too early, Melly! Oh, dancer, do something! Dancer! Oh, Mary's a bot, Mary's a bot! No, never mind. Okay. Come on, dancer! Do something! Sorry, I'm not running for Mary after what she did to me yesterday. <laughs> oh, but the. She's back in the slow box! Yeah, oh, but she's trying to see toward the. Oh, is she gonna go for the antiquarian on the cipher? No, okay, okay, she's ignoring that cipher. Even though it could uh, reduce the cipher rush. Come on, dancer. Do something. Don't die. Let Melly. Oh, into Square out of nowhere. Beautiful. Has the Chinese New Year accessory too. Oh my gosh. Wait, but she, the cipher, that cipher is losing decoding now. Hold on now. That is both good and bad for the antiquarian. Um, let's see. Break it. Yup, yup. Stall, stall. Beautiful, beautiful. Antiquarian's back on the cipher. Melly Gaming. Melly, no. Melly, please. Melly, look out. Yes. Yes. Horse kite. Get on the horse. Melly's on the horse. Yeah. Woo. Melly on the horse. Oh, but she's, she spotted out the dancer, though. Okay, drop the pallet. Smart. Oh, I'm Mary. I gotta break that pallet. <laughs> yeah, back in your box. Back in your box. Okay, no blink this time, but Mira's about to be ready. That's actually such a good box. What the heck? That box license is crazy on Kreeberg. Uh, also, I've been told it's apparently pronounced Kreiberg. Like Frederick Kreiberg. Which is weird because they literally pronounce it as Kreeberg in the game. So I don't I don't know. It, it, it seems kind of weird. That, like, the official game would mispronounce it. I don't know. I still think Kreeberg sounds better, but whatever. Um, anyways. Charles, do your thing, bro. Do your thing! Oh, wait. The middle cipher is the last cipher? Wait, that's actually kind of bad because it's kind of hard to prime it. Like, when it's primed, it can go... Oh, they just they just pop? Okay. Um, who are you going after? Go after Antiquarian, not Melly. Never mind, Melly, you got this. Melly, 10,000 cipher kite. Here we go. The flywheel. Beautiful! Run her over! Run her over! No! I wanted to run her over! It would've been so funny! Yo, Melly's crazy, bro. She just gets on the horse and is like, goodbye. I don't even care about you. Oh, wait, but Antiquarian on the door, though. Antiquarian opened up the door. She's too slow with it. You're too slow with it. She could just blink down. Now nah, she's gonna mirror. Oh, mirror's so ugly, bro. That didn't hit. I don't even care. That didn't hit. That did not hit. That didn't hit. Bruh. That literally did not hit her. Bruh. That is cringe. Teleport now. Teleport. Just do it! Teleport so you can get, I don't know, hit by bees. There, okay, she's doing it now. Look out, guys! Melly! Melly, run! You're the flywheel! <gasps> no! Don't you die. Guys, don't you dare run away. Charles! Yes! Hover! Get away! Dancer, don't you dare run out. Don't do it. You abandoned Melly? You're ugly. You're ugly. You abandoned Melly. You're ugly. Melly. Nope, nope, nope. I can't watch this, bro. You're telling me she doesn't get out a second time? No. Charles, wrong person. Charlie. Bro, I swear, you better rescue that antiquarian right now and get your butt back over here and rescue Melly and get out the door. Please. Antiquarian, he can get this rescue just barely. Charles, you need to clutch up right now, bro. Charles, my best friend. Rescue's an Aquarian. An Aquarian, you need to sacrifice yourself. Hit Mary like a thousand times. She's going for Charles. You're so ugly. Go for Antiquarian. Get the. Go for Antiquarian. Stop going for Charles. No. Stop. No, bro. Bro, stop going for Charles. No. You're so ugly, Mary. Wait, the tension ran out. The tension ran out. Charles, what you do? Sacrifice yourself. Sacrifice yourself for Melly. Mirror is not up. Running thing. Oh my gosh, the bees. Where's Dungeon? I don't even know. Charles! Charles, bro. Bro, Charles. Charles! Charles! Oh my gosh. I hate Mary. 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 You're telling me the only one that doesn't make it out? 
I hate Mary! I hate you! 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 <sighs> delete Mary. Actually, delete Mary. You're, you're my number one target to be deleted from this game now. How dare you? All right, here we go. Third time's a charm. Melly, Charles, Dancer, Anti, same team. Whoa, Anti, you're crazy. Anti, whoa. <laughs> Versus an opera singer. Oh, boy. All right, yeah, chase, chase the Dancer first. Now let Melly get out. Everybody stop and fight yourself for Melly right now. I know this match already happened, but like, truly the spirit of me from the past is imbuing all these people that don't speak the same language as me. Uh, <laughs> sacrifice themselves for Melly. They'll understand. They got it. They got it. They know. Okay, go back to that fast box. Oh, zoom. Wait. Oh, zoom again. You Spin, spin. Oh, pallet. Yeah, pallet's been on that opera. Pallet's been on that opera. Come on, dancer. You need to kite as long as possible for Melly. Do it for Melly. Yeah, do it for a small slow box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now you can transition. Beautiful, beautiful. Waste all those boxes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Beautiful. Wait. She's not even breaking the boxes. Opera. Why? What? 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 Huh? Yo, she's crazy. She vaulted into her flywheel. Dancer. Don't flop now. Another box? Yeah. Loop, 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 loop. Woo. Yeah. The slow boxes do indeed stack. No! Now she can down dancer and clean up all the boxes. Oh. No, Blink, you had to ruin all the fun. Blink, you ruined all the fun. And Melly's right there. No, be careful, Melly. Melly, be careful. She's gonna clean up all the boxes. No! No, let just let yourself lose. Don't clean up the boxes. No, they're not doing anything wrong. What did the boxes ever do to you? Bruh. No, this area was so good. Why are you cutting toward Melly? Oh, the bees! Melly, careful! Oh, did you pull him back? Did you pull him back? I can't tell if you pulled him back. She didn't pull them back. No, she lost like 50% of her bees. Melly! Melly, don't do it. Don't sacrifice yourself for Dancer. It should be the other way around. Oh, please. Dancer, you need to kite like a god so that Melly can escape. Please. Please. Yes, Melly finishes effort. You're so cool, Melly. Come on. You can win. You can win. Yes, yes. Pallet spam. Pallet spam that opera. Pallet spammer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pallet spam. What are you doing? Oh, wait, she's crazy. She's not that crazy. Never mind. She was almost crazy. Melly! What are you doing? Melly, why'd you go right up to her? I don't understand. No, Charles, bro. Charles, oh no, she forced him to use a jetpack. That's not good. I mean, it's better than taking a hit. Better than taking a hit, I guess, but did force him to use an item. Now he only has one jetpack left. I don't know where Melly went. I don't know what Melly was doing. Wait, did Melly just try to open a chest for her or something? Is Melly crazy? Is Melly cracked? Melly, be careful. Melly, oh. No, Charles, you do the rescue. Don't use your jetpack, bro. Melly's coming. Oh, Melly. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Eey, eey. Attacks nothing. Okay, offers a bot. Careful, don't get terror shocked, Melly. Woo! You're scaring me. Yeah, yeah. Oh! No, she didn't get in time. Oh, she was almost insane. She was almost insane. Yo! This is what I'm, that's what I'm talking about, bro. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, oh Anticrine, you're a bot. Dancer's dead. Don't you dare chase Melly. Chase Charles. Dude, did you see what Melly tried to do? She tried to push Opera into the pallet, but she, and she was so close, but she couldn't get off her bees in time. Charles, no, please, please don't throw. They're on the cipher. She backflips towards it. Antiquary, do something. Ah, stop. You missed all your swings. You're such a bot. No, she's fine. She's better than my Antiquary, but still, I just want this Melly to get out, bro. So I'm, I'm just yelling at everybody else to protect her. Melly, look out. Oh, she's crazy, but the don't you blink her. Don't do it, man. Ah, what the, is that cypher at? I don't know. Somebody ping your progress. The hover. He used up all his resources. Everybody's dead. What do they do? She can just guard the cypher. Bro, soft tab normal would be funny. I mean, don't. Don't actually do that. Don't do that. Don't soft tab normal. Actually, she soft tab normal. Does she just win? Does she just win if she soft tab normal? Uh. So, um. How long are we doing this for? <laughs> Do you not just swap to abnormal and do this? I mean, no, Melly's bees. Ah, what happens here? Charles is digging up a chest. He's gonna have something. He has a syringe. 
Charles, don't get hit. Use that syringe, bro. Use that syringe. Yeah, 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 yeah. Use that syringe. Use that syringe. <laughs> Melly, no. Melly, Melly. Melly. Oh. Bro. Charles, you need to heal, take the hit, and then go in, bro. Oh, his healing is healing. Yes, this syringe could be the game changer. Melly, no. Don't go after Melly, bro. Oh, dude. Ah, I'm so scared. This is such a standstill, bro. No, she did it. No. Charles. He has his heal primed. He has his heal primed. She's gonna chair anti. She's gonna chair anti. No, it's primed. It's primed. It's primed. She could just have normal it though. He primes it. He primes it. Bees, bees. It's not gonna be enough though. All right, all right, all right. Charles goes for the save. Melly pops. Charles goes for the save. Melly pop. Charles save. Melly pop. Charles save. Melly pop. Charles save. Melly pop. Charles save. Okay. Yes. Charles. Oh, you're not about. Let's go. Yeah. Woo. Okay. If she goes to up, oh, she pops. She pops. I say, if she goes for you, just pop it. Come on. Melly, get out. Charles kite. Use that syringe. Just stab her with the syringe. Stab her with the syringe. Come on, Charles. 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 Come on, Charles. Yes. Charles. You're crazy. He's crazy. He's crazy. Yes. Opera swinging like a madman. No. Don't teleport. Don't trace up. Teleport. Don't trace up. Teleport. Don't do it. No. Melly, get out of there, man. Yes. Anti hitter. Oh. Two. One. Okay. Yes. Anti, you are now you are now officially on melee protection duty. Even though you have no more flute left. <laughs> Come on, you used to be an assassin. Just kill Opera. Just kill her. Just stab her. <laughs> Go pick up Charles' syringe. Oh, oh, pal, mind game, pal, mind game. Oh, but the trade, though. Wait, Melly, where are you? Is Melly getting out? Is Melly getting out? Charles got stuck out. Melly, come on. Open the gate, please. Oh, she can make it in time, can't she? Melly, please. It's at 50%. No, man. I don't know if they can make it. Please. Please. She can make it. I think they can make it. I think they can make it. Oh, please. No, 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 no. She did it. She made it out. Yes. Auntie, you don't have flywheel. You can't make that. No, Auntie can't get out. She can't get she, She's done. She's done. She's clipped. She's clipped. Yo, she was almost crazy. Yo, get hit by the tram opera. No, Auntie, not you. Oh, she just surrenders after that. Gosh dang it. <laughs> All right, all that's important is Melly made it out. That's all that matters. I don't even care. Sorry, Auntie, you got hit by a freaking tram. It doesn't matter to me. Melly made it out. That's what matters. That's what matters. <sighs> the world's at peace now. Anyways, that's going to be it for today, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you all later. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye!